So we've applied our Ana block, we've created a couple of subtracks and gone in and fine-tuned our animation a little bit, but I can see the timing of the loop is just a little bit off. It seems it takes her right foot less time to hit than her left foot. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to the end of the loop and I'm going to go back two frames and I'm going to pull all of these in and crop them. And the timing on that looks a lot better. So I'm going to keep it two frames shorter. And what we're going to do now is we're going to take all this data and combine it down into one Ana block. That way we can apply that Ana block to other characters or use it in other projects. And how we do that? Right click anywhere in this area and we're going to bake to studio keyframes. And we'll just hit yes. So you can see the keyframes have been created in the timeline. Now the timeline has control of the scene rather than animate. So you can actually go ahead and delete these. And I'm actually going to leave this last one because sometimes when you delete this, the scrubber stop goes to its default position of one second. So I'm going to leave that one there because when that scrubber stop goes down, that changes the length of the timeline. So with our keyframes in timeline, we're going to go back into Animate 2, right click and create Anablock from Studio Keyframes. We're going to leave it as Transform to Objects POV, and you're gonna want to have Translate, Rotation, and Morphs selected. And if you do any scaling in your keyframes, you're gonna want that selected too. These morphs you do want to have selected because the hand movements were all done through morphing. And once this is created, then you can actually save it right here. And you can name it whatever you want. I'm just going to call mine sultry -er walk. So let's go ahead and bring up a new scene. Let's add a new Genesis 3 character. And we're going to put some clothes on her. And once that's loaded up, let's search for our sultry, sultry or walk right here. Let's apply that. And there you go.